always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. But a pretty fascinating afternoon of weather as we continue to see scattered showers roll through West Michigan. And as we take a look out over downtown Grand Rapids, you can see just that one of those showers located on the horizon. And they look pretty mean and scary, really not much more than just some rain, perhaps even some snow and grapple at times. What's making it look so dark is the fact that we have sunshine in between showers. Truly feels like a lake effect kind of day, but it's not. We're dealing with showers associated with a low pressure system that continues to hang around and showers are lifting north across most of the area. And pretty persistent uh, across most of West Michigan. That's going to be the case for us over the next 24 hours. So we expect showers here this evening. Make it a brief lull at times overnight tonight. More widespread precipitation, though, is set to roll in through much of the day tomorrow. The reason why these bars are pink is because it will likely continue to be a mixture of some rain and snow. So future cast, as we walk you through tonight, you see the mixture of green and blue. It means some snowflakes will continue to mix in from time to time. Perhaps a brief lull overnight, but by the time we get to the morning drive on Thursday, notice the steadier precipitation begins to arrive. A mixture of rain and snow. Better chance of seeing plain old rain as we get later on in the day. But much of the morning going to feature precipitation for most of West Michigan. That continues through the afternoon, transitioning to more scattered showers like what we've been seeing today but we don't get rid of the precipitation. A few showers remain possible into the day on Friday, but for the most part, we should begin to dry things out. Uh, shower coverage will not be nearly as widespread as it has been over the last several days. Additional precipitation amounts likely on the order of a quarter inch or less. We've certainly seen our fair share this week. It does look like this will be the last of it as we get closer to the weekend. Your forecast for Thursday, again, features that mix of rain and snow temperatures in the mid 40s. Mid 40s again for us on Friday, partly cloudy with the chance of an isolated shower during the afternoon. Warm up commences into the weekend. Want to take it back to the UP? You just heard about it a minute ago. Snow continues to fall across parts of the Upper Peninsula. It's from my friend Kinnon up in Lots, uh, right at the base of Keweenaw Bay. And <laughs> more snow than I think they would care to see this late in the year. Goes to show this time of year we can see just about anything. Today marks 68 years since the Hudsonville Standale tornado of 1956, the last F5 tornado to occur in Michigan unfortunately claiming 17 lives. Thankfully, your eight-day forecast doesn't have any severe weather. It does have that chance for showers through the day tomorrow. Some nicer weather is on the way, though, as we get closer to the weekend with high temperatures up in the low 60s by early next week. So one more day of some unsettled weather, and then we get a break. Yeah. Some nice weather to enjoy. Much and that looks, break. Yeah, that looks nice, too. I mean, it warms up and stays there for Classic a while. Classic spring-like weather, Comfy. so we'll take Great. that. Great. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Blake, thank you.